Everywhere you went, there was people. Later on, they ended up having to close the doors. They couldn't let anyone else in. It was so crowded. Just a moment. A group of 20 women in San Antonio, all in their 60s and 70s. At 9 o'clock at night, and they said, we are going to the Capitol. They wanted to be part of this. They wanted to say, stop this. I've seen the women who marched on Washington back in the day, and then young people who've never been to any kind of action in their life. It was really cool, the kind of sense of community it was, just creating like this bond that, you know, no matter what happens, we're all still gonna be in this together for the long run. moments in the day when the building would literally come alive. I could feel it under my feet. That was a clip from a new documentary, Shouting Down Midnight, which revisits the story of Texas Senator Wendy Davis and her marathon filibuster of the state's abortion restriction bill in 2013. It is part of Trevor Noah's new docuseries, The Turning Point, and it's set to air on this network this Sunday night at 10 p.m. Joining me once again is Trevor Noah, host of The Daily Show. Trevor, Tell me about, the, I think some of us remember this, mm -hmm. but seeing it, reliving it in a way, it, it, you can viscerally, like, you can feel the emotion of that moment, yes. the excitement, the sense of possibility. Why did you, how did you get involved with this? And, and, and sort of more urgently, why now? Why, why release this now? You know, what's sad is when I got involved in this project, this, this documentary in particular, wasn't as pressing as it is now. Yeah. You know, when we were speaking of it, we were speaking of it, you know, in, in, a, th in a theoretical way. Everyone was saying, will the Republicans do this? Are they going to take it? And Republicans, you know, as even Chris Hayes was talking about, would come and say, no, there will be exceptions. This is not what we look... It's not nationwide. This is not what it's going... And here you have now a country where women all over the continent are saying, what is going to happen? From the East Coast to the West Coast, women are saying, what is going to happen? Will we have control over our bodies? And in making this documentary, what, what I loved about the storytelling, and each, each part of, of Turning Point is made by different filmmakers, produced by different people, because I think each story is so unique. This story isn't just about that moment when Wendy Davis stood up there and basically, I mean, fought for all these women's rights and yeah. said, I will stand here, even though I know we will lose, I will stand here despite that. It became about what it inspired, not just in her community, but in, in multiple areas where people said, we need to fight for our rights to control our own bodies. Yeah, and I mean, how prescient that fight now seems, yeah. right?